Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2019-2020 Panini, Panini, Panini Prism, a lot of ends there. Panini Prism Basketball Retail Edition, five box, quarter of a case, random team break number 15. You can see that the next break is already in the store, but this is break 1-5, as it says in the little spray paint there. Big thanks to nobody. Big thanks to these folks for getting into it. Oh, there's an early bird, that's right. If you're one of the first 20, like these people right here, you have a chance at that early bird spot. So name on top after seven will be the early bird that catches the worm. One, two, three, four, five, six, and good luck. Seventh and final time. Congrats to Adam McKelly. If I was Adam Kelly and if I played sports in high school, I would always get Number 47, because then I'd be AK-47. Woo! That'd be fire. Congrats, Adam. Thank you for getting in. Now, different dice roll for the uh, randomizer here. And there's all the teams right there. All 30 are in. Let's roll it. Let's randomize it five times this time. One and a four. One, two, three, four, five. Rich down to AK-47. I don't think it's that, but I can dream. One and a four, five times for the teams. <clears throat> and five. After five, we got the Bulls down to the Warriors. Did Rich get the Bulls again? Yes, that I will do. If it sells out, I'll do it by the end of the uh, by the end of NT. All right. So Rich with the Bulls, Matthew with the Jazz, Kevin with the Sixers, Jennifer with the Pistons, Mark with the Suns, Danny with the Spurs, Ryosuke Kimura with the Nets, Alex Williams with the Mavs, Jack with the Kings, Scott with the Hornets, Curtis with the Clips, Mark with the Celtics. The early bird spot for Adam yields him the Heat. Ryosuke with the Toronto Raptors, Derek with the uh, Pacers, Anthony P with the Wizards, Darren Dmac with the Thunder, Matt McRae with my Lakers, Brian F, you got the Trailblazers, John with the Nuggets, Danny with the Magic, Josh with the Grizz, Matthew, Rockets, Kevin, T-Wolves, Thomas, Bucks, Pat, uh, Hawks, John with the Cavs, Rob with the Pelicans and the Knicks, nice random, and Adam with the Warriors. All right, now, while you're considering trades, there's the stack right there that we opened up earlier today. Remember, I put all X's on there so you know they're from the same case. Let's select a die. We'll go one, two, three, four, five, six with that die right there. Five, one, two, three, four, five, six. So it'll be the far five boxes, right? These are kind of heavy. Unexpectedly heavy for how small they are. They're very dense, like a uh, like the black hole. A lot of density there, like a neutron star, I think. All right, no trades. Oh, I need the title. No trades, right? No. Okay. TWC trade window closed. Let's print. Let's rip. All the silver inside weighing it down. This time the prism silver is made with real silver. All right, good luck ladies and gentlemen. We got the sounds of Iron Chef America in the background here. I don't know what they're making. Is that scallops? That's pretty good. Oh. Mm. All right, good luck everybody. Thank you. 
mortadella fried chicken? By the way, here is the uh, final list right here on a Saturday. Hey, thanks for hanging out with us on a Saturday, boys and girls. I pre really appreciate that. There could be a lot of things you could be doing. Watching Iron Chef America, perhaps. Mortadella mac and cheese. I don't know, Todd Father. You could be, you could be, not spending time in front of the computer, playing board games, making a puzzle. Maybe uh, you're making a Millennium Falcon Lego set. You know, maybe you're watching a watching a movie on the big TV, and everyone's saying, "Dad, turn off the laptop." You know. Be a lot of things you could be doing. Cleaning the house, going to sleep. You bedtime. Be a lot of things. Carson Edwards is your auto. Matt, uh, Mark B with Boston. Well, I appreciate that, Todd. I'm here. I'm here for you. You are getting sleepy. Woo! Woo! That is hot. Pink Pulsar. Zion Williamson for Rob and the Pelicans. 21 out of 42. How, how, how much am I holding in my hand right now? Someone look that up. Those have got to be doing pretty nicely. We'll get one of those though. We'll get one of those. Out of fives and under, get the train whistle, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, there's Ion right here too. Emergent. Nice start for Rob and the Pelicans. I'm celebrating. The train whistle celebrates the uh, celebrates the rarity, the numerical rarity of the card. That makes it easier. As a host, Adam S, you you would uh, if you were a host, you would understand that because then you'd be like, well, then you can split hairs on. So there's all Zions. What do I do when I pull an out of five Zion? Then I can't do more than a train whistle. Where would I go from there? Rick Butler says, Pink Pulsar graded 10 went, went for $9,300. So what, raw, half, half that, maybe three raw? It's pretty nice. Pretty, pretty nice. Maybe three, four and a half raw, perhaps? 
maybe two, two and a half, three around there. But still, pretty nice. And PJ Washington for Scott and the Hornets. Nice, nice Hornet. Tremont Waters, silver rookie. And another pink Pulsar, Grant Hill. 20 out of 42 on that one. Pistons, Grant Hill for Jennifer and the Tremont Waters for Mark. This is mortadella wrapped pie. On top you'll find a little bit of mortadella breadcrumbs as well in case there wasn't enough mortadella. Well, I don't really taste the flavor of the mortadella. This is very, very well cooked. I'll send that Kobe too. And I love how you treated the mortadella. It's almost like... Nice emergent John Morant. Rick Butler looked at Card Snoop and said raw pink Pulsar Zion went for five back in January. Well, that's pretty crazy. Adam's asking, besides the last two years... Oh, these red waves are not numbered, so they'll they'll ship. But I'm just breezing by those. Save a LeBron too. He's selling okay. He's all right. Adam S is asking. Besides the last two years, are there any other prism sets that are as expensive? Uh, probably the whatever Giannis year. Any any product for Giannis's rookie year is pretty expensive. So any any basketball product from that year is super expensive. I'm pretty sure Beckett is. Their offices are closed, Scott. State mandated closure. So I don't think they have like a full staff working there. So. And PSA is in Southern California. They're maybe about an hour or so south of us. And yeah, they, they closed up shop too. I mean, there might be one person rattling around in there just to, I don't know. I'm sure there's things that, that they can do without a full staff there. But yeah, for, the, for all intents and purposes, no grading for a while. So, uh, so when you see, whenever we do mixers where we're giving away graded cards, get into those. Already graded for you. I think someone asked this question the other day. Um, do, you, do we think that the... Has there been a boost in graded card value... You know, is there a, bo a small boost in graded card value just because things are, um, because Beckett and PSA are shut down for a little bit? Oh, so Scott's saying that maybe you can still mail, you can still send them in, but no one's actually grading them at the moment. Wait, 
All right, next box. Good luck, everybody. This is a uh, random team break 15. The next one is in the store, so check it out. We'll be able to do that tomorrow. Tomorrow. PJ Washington Silver, nice. For the Hornets. Porzingis Silver. Kayvon Looney, D'Angelo Russell. Ben Simmons, Emergent Goga. Harris Levert, Green. So Greens, once again, just like the Red Waves are not numbered, but they will ship. I think only veteran commons won't be shipping. But inserts like that will, of course, will ship. Tyler Hero will ship, too. Because he's a rookie. It's got the RC on there. And Jackson Hayes is your autograph. Rookie penmanship. Nice. No. NT's already full. I'm afraid. John Morant. Instant Impact, John Moran. That's for the Grizzlies. That'll go to Josh. Don't take if you're allergic to Nurtec. How do I know until I try? Now, ladies and gentlemen, I am booked for the night, but if you have the itch to break, um, we do have personal breaks on our Instagram. No, only veteran commons do not ship. Everything else does. Michael Buble. All righty. Next box. Good luck, RJ Barrett. So, so Josh, that won't ship, that won't ship, that will ship, that will not ship, that will not ship, this will ship, that won't, that won't, that won't, this will, that will, and these inserts will, that insert will. And there's Alan Samilich. For the Warriors, that'll be for Adam Kelly. Go, America. Let's do it. 
Hachimura Red Wave will definitely ship to Anthony Parkinson with the Wizards. Nice. Nice silver instant impact, John Morant. Another one for uh, another John Morant for Josh. We won Iron Chef, ladies and gentlemen, this episode anyway. <laughs> International competition. Beat those stupid Brits. 1776, baby. And base John Morant. Silver would be nice. There you go, Josh. All right, and fifth and final box, boys and girls. There'll be more in the store that we can do tomorrow. There's more in the store right now, but it'll break tomorrow. this episode already. Last box. Good luck. You once participated in my next Iron Chef competition. You did not win, and Iron Chef Simon was a judge. Cam Johnson, rookie silver. Or do you harbor a judge grudge and plan to serve a cold dish of revenge? Oh, we definitely saw this one. Feud? Yeah. Show me Luka Doncic. Show me Terrence Mann. That goes to Curtis and the Clippers. Whoa. Whoa. Family show, Jen. Luka Doncic going to Alex Williams and the Dallas Mavericks. A weak, John. That was a weak answer. Even his family's not saying good answer, good answer. That's when you know it's bad. When your own family isn't giving you the good answer, good answer. Another John Morant. Whoa! 
Recreational drugs, says Pamela. Grandma has a little bit of Molly in the bag. Wait, what? Family show. <laughs> yeah, it was marijuana. Fat doobie. Is what the answer was. Will Chamberlain. Sexy undies. False teeth. Gun. All right. Show me Zion base for Rob and the Pelicans. This is why we, that, that's why he's a treasure, BJ Jordan. That's why Steve Harvey's a treasure. Because of his inappropriate and untimely comments. While you're having... Yep. Don't call him by the wrong name. All right. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Not too shabby, actually. Let's go through this. Some Jaws, some Zions, right? And then that pink Pulsar. Woo! Some pretty nice stuff. Thanks for watching, everyone. Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. I'll see you next time for the next break. Bye-bye.